Hey guys, how's it going? My name is RGJ Runner, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Aria, or Aria, whatever you want to call it. I'm sick of trying to be perfect at this stage. Either way, we are on chapter eight. Yikes, that was kind of loud. Got to turn down the volume a small bit. Oh Jesus Christ! Not again. The game didn't save. Ah, uh, all right. I'll be back to you guys in a second. All right, we're we are back on track now. We're on chapter eight currently, <laughs> playing as Rama, and I have to follow a little girl. But before I follow a little girl, I will do some research and try and find some notes. Is there anything in here? Yep. Great, I wasted 15 seconds of precious video time already. Good job. Oh, there's one right here. Kuman Thong is the spirit of a fetus that died before being born. First, the unborn fetus is surgically removed from the womb or of its mother. Then the body of the child is taken to a cemetery for the conduction of the proper ceremonial ritual. The body is roasted until dry and is then painted and covered in a golden leaf, which is why he is called Kuman Thong, Golden Little Boy. Oh god, that, that's awful to be honest. Come find me. Okay. Anyway, as I was saying, uh, don't care what part of the world you're from, that is creepy. Speaking of creepy, this looks like a creepy area. You can't go in there yet. So, any more Can notices you guess that. Where I am? Oh. Yeah, don't need to guess anymore. I'd much rather not go in there. I'd much rather go in here. I mean, this this place looks fun. Okay, can't go in there yet. Again, I'm just wondering about to see if I can find any more notes in case I miss any and I can't backtrack. So there's none down here either. Okay, right. Moving on to find a scary little girl. Oh, this is not even okay. Oh, something scary is going to happen now when I pick this up. A child shirt. That's all. Nothing else is going to happen. Okay, let's close this door out. So, that's it. Just went all that way to find a child's shirt. Lovely. Okay, I can't go in there yet either. So, I'm guessing the only way is forward. Oh, this door is now open. Okay. Oh, this does not bode well. Okay, got multiple notices. Ooh, scary. A medical bill from the hospital that says the recipient was charged 45,000 baht. And on the bottom is a signature that says Rama. Okay, I get it. I think. The medical, uh, the medical record of a little girl called Den Duen Arikai Arichai? Arikai? I'm going to say Arikai. Okay. The, medical, uh, the medical record of a little girl called 
pretend one, Arakai. She is diagnosed with meningitis. Oh, so I'm guessing this must be Rama's daughter. Oh, okay, this makes sense. Although I thought the picture that we saw in the first episode or the second episode was a picture of his wife or um, no, it was definitely a picture of his daughter but she looked to be a lot older just saying okay right, now the door is open ooh, this is kinda cool so what do I need to do now? Death certificate of a little girl called Dentuan Arakai. The cause of death is listed as complications as a result of meningitis. Oh, dude, that is sad. Okay, there's only one more door to be unlocked, and it's this one. No. Oh, okay, yeah, this one back here. Come on, close that. Nope. That is the opposite of closing. Okay, there we go. Oh. oh my god. So I guess I'm in the spirit world now, am I? Yeah, I'm back here again. Oh, okay, little girl, what scared she has in store for me this time? <laughs> Where is she? Find three keys to open the door. Oh man, where the hell am I going to find three keys? Okay, obviously one of them is going to be in here. Which I cannot get to. Or can I? Uh, I have to go around the other side. Jeez. Oh, this part of the game is definitely going to be a key collecting simulator. Where I came from. Oh God. Okay, so much more could have been done with these mummified corpses. I mean, they could have chased me or, or something. No, they're just here for aesthetic purposes, so it would seem. Oh god. Um, do I have to go down there? Is going down here a, a thing? Yeah, gotta leave it for the time being. First off, I want to collect that key I saw earlier on. There's one of the keys. Birthday card. It has a message inside. Happy bur Ugh. Happy birthday, ploy. Daddy will come to see you soon. Guessing that's from Rama to his daughter, and, and maybe Ploy is a nickname he gave for her. Yeah, it's all come together in a nice little package. I can't go down there, so I must have to jump down this hole. Oh, and I can climb back up. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Oh my god, I can't see diddly dick here. Let me 
make sure that I'm not missing anything. And no, I'm not. Good. Oh my god, the controls are so clunky. Isn't the key that I missed? Oh, that's another room opened up somewhere upstairs, and I just didn't realize it. Okay, I've already been in here. This is where I started off. I feel like this game's trying to take the piss out of me or something. Yeah, let's, let's just can't open that. Oh! Oh, Jesus God! <laughs> Damn it! What the hell is that? Oh my god. I actually want to get a screenshot. Hey buddy. Uh, you seem to be dripping blood there. You alright? <laughs> alright, good luck and thanks. I'm out here. Oh, close the door. Okay. Right. That took me about a good 10 or 15 minutes to figure it out. I didn't realize there were multiple locks. Well, silly me. Oh. This looks kind of grim. You don't have any keys hidden under you, do you? Not gonna fall on top of me now. Okay, good. Yeah, this is very Silent Hill-esque here. Wouldn't be surprised if there was some inspiration drawn from it. Going there, what about here? Oh, yeah, this looks like a good area. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's very grim indeed. Oh, a wobby pop candy. Surely it's not edible anymore. I don't know, maybe you should try it. So I guess I go back up again. What the fuck? Uh-oh, come on, close that door. Okay, I get Oh my god, I can't I cannot move. Oh what? How did I die? That was Okay, there we go. And I can't use my flashlight again. Okay, alright, I know what I have to do. I have to go back and get the keys again. Oh, get up! Is he seriously still chasing me? Oh, 
Okay, that's Grim. This is seriously Grim. Oh. And everything's back to normal now. Somewhat normal. So now I can get another key. Is this other key of greatness? Probably going to be downstairs again somewhere. Okay, this is new. You, what should we put those hands? Oh, this just looks like complete fun. You're not gonna chase me now, right? You guys? No, uh, I don't think so. Be kind of fun if you did, though. Open up there. There we go. And the third key is down here somewhere. Fuck you, bridge. Uh, it's gonna be here. I can feel it in my bones. Okay, uh, maybe not. We can all be wrong from time to times. Surely in this red door. No, this is inaccessible. This one? Oh, definitely this one. I'm sure of it. Never been so sure of anything in my life. There it is. Oh, I can, uh, how handy. I can go out the other door. Oh, God. Okay, I just kind of wandered in here by a complete accident. So, um, what's this now? Oh, yeah, th this is the picture that we saw in Chapter 2 of Rama and his daughter. Either Rama's really short for his age, or his daughter is really big for her age. Okay. So it wasn't his wife or girlfriend, it's his daughter. That makes so much more sense. So are we done with the screaming and the chasing now? Yeah, we're good. Okay, good. Okay, I guess not. Oh my god. Oh shit. I'm actually kind of lost now. 
Uh, no, 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 not here. Ah, shit. Oh, shit, stickums. Across the bridge. Oh, Oh, this is just one mind fuck of a game. Oh, here. This would be a much more touching scene if the screaming would stop. Subtitles. See if it can make any sense of this. If there is any subtitles. Okay, so Toy was a nickname for his daughter. At least that's what I got out of it from. At least what I could overhear from the screaming. Jesus, this game is as bugged out as all hell. Yeah, that would have been a much more touching scene if there wasn't any screaming in the background. That was awful. This is the way we came with Marissa, wasn't it? Oh, I, like, I like the touching music. So there's no more notes to be collected, I assume. Hold on. Yeah, that's 
the last. Oh yeah, this was where we finished off with Marissa. What the hell is going on in this I'm, room? I don't know. You should ask your boss. Oh yeah, there's Marissa. Tempering Soraya's spirit by pulling out the nail. Huh? That's that's the corpse of that missing woman. Okay, now I'm just more curious as to how she got down here. Special nail that is used to seal a spirit. Okay, what did I do now? Are you okay, miss? Oh shit! What the hell? Okay, he's gonna spare him. I pressed E! <laughs> oh, and there's, uh, what's his name? Uh, Jesus, I forgot his name. Okay, wait. This is still chapter 8, is it? Oh, jeez, I'm not, I'm not even sure at this stage, but I'm just going to call it a video because I've been playing it for well over half an hour. Jeez. <coughs> well, so far, well, in this chapter, it's been a buggy mess. I mean, the best part of it was ruined by the freaking child screaming. <sighs> uh, I, I don't know, maybe there will be an update to it to fix it because that was the mo most touching scene, or that it could have been more touching. Aside from the distorted screaming, as I've already mentioned. But yeah, either way, it's uh, put a lot of things in into perspective. It's cleaned up a lot of loose ends, so to speak. Anyway, I'm going to stop rambling on here. So guys, you know what to do. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, comment here, share, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. So, until next time, see ya.